he told me, he said, you have cancer in your liver now. And I said, okay, we can handle that. So this time I had a different visit with God about this, this round of cancer. I said, I've only been here six months. I'm happy here. I just love it here. Will you let me hang around a while? I went out the door here at the village where I go to walk on the campus and I raised my arms and I said, well, God, we got another battle, but I want to hang around a while. And is that okay with you? Because I know it's not my will, but your will be done. Well, now that was a year ago, last August. And so I've had this year of just having the time of my life and enjoying being here in Arkansas. But the, the last month or six weeks, my cancer has wakened up and I'm on my way home. They first talked to me about uh, going in a hospice. My husband was in hospice. He was only there about two weeks when he died. And I, my first reaction was, well, I'm not ready to, to die. I'm, I'm not done yet. And so I found out about hospice. And hospice is, is the most wonderful thing. Beth comes once a week, and Beth loves me. And she's so kind. And she sits and talks to me. And I look forward to Tuesdays when, when Beth comes to see me. But she surprised me one time and she says, I've got it all lined up for you to ride a motorcycle. So I was just really excited about that. And that's something else the hospice did for me. They, they really care about you. And so, yeah, they came out with this motorcycle and they brought me out a leather jacket that we were supposed to wear on the motorcycle and brought me out a, the, the helmet to wear. And uh, all of my friends at the breakfast table and the lunch table, they all came out and watched me ride. One of my friends said to me, how old are you, Lois? And I said, I'm 89, and you're going to ride a motorcycle? I said, yeah. What does age have to do with it? Um, I'm happy with hospice. I'm thankful for hospice, uh, and I think my kids are thankful for hospice too. But what hospice does for you, it, 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 it's wonderful. I can't, I can't give really enough praise to hospice for what they do for me. It's very comforting to know that Beth is going to be with me and we're going to finish up this this road ourselves and hospice is going to be with me and 